everyone welcome back to my channel today i'll be showing you guys a fun fabulous and fierce hairstyle using a drawstring ponytail this is super quick and it's great for you guys who don't feel like combing here this holiday season try this hairstyle using a drawstring ponytail it's so much fun you guys so I'm gonna go ahead and put my hair in a high puff and I'm using a elastic hair tie. Now for this tutorial, um, you wanna get your puff as small as you can. Mine was small enough and I end up looking like I have a camel hump on the top of my hair. <laughs> but it's okay, I will be doing this hairstyle over again and make my bun a little bit more smaller. As you can see, my gray hairs are getting really out of control lately, so I've been using mascara to conceal it and it works really, really well. <laughs> so back to my hair, I'm going to go ahead and apply some Eco Styler Gel to my edges only because, again, I already have um, gel in my hair from my previous hairstyle. So I'm only adding to the edges and also the back part of my hair as well, just to get it really nice and smooth. <laughs> After your hair is nice and smooth, I do recommend you leave a satin head scarf on your hair for like 20 minutes to really smooth it out. Then I'm gonna go ahead and just apply a stocking cap to my ends because you don't want that to be out underneath your wig. And do make your puff a little bit more smaller than mine because mine was a little bit too big just to prevent your hair from looking like a hump on the top part of your head. So do go ahead and make it a lot more smaller than mine. So the hair I'm going to be using today is a full cap drawstring wig from Free Tress. It's called Celtic Girl. We we'll have all the details in the bottom off. You guys go ahead and check it out. You can wear this as a half wig, a full wig, or you can wear it as a drawstring ponytail. And I've been really into drawstring ponytails lately, you guys. So we go ahead and just apply that over my puff like so. I'm gonna go ahead and just draw the string really nice and tight to secure the ponytail on my head. And again, I've been really into quick protective styling like this and I've been loving my drawstring ponytail because it's very quick and fun and easy to do. So after my little five minute moment with this hair, as you can see, I was having so much fun. I'm going to take the little drawstring that's remaining and just go ahead and just secure it right underneath my hair into the bun to make sure it's nice and secure and no one can see it. Yes, and this is what your hair actually looks like. It's very, very full. Again, make sure your puff is a lot more smaller than mine to prevent any hump in the top of your hair like so. Besides that, it is so fabulous. I'm going to go ahead and use some bobby pins and flip my hair over to the side because I love to rock my hair on the side. I think it just follows my face shape and it's Obviously, it's fierce and I really love it. So I'm just taking a little bit of hair and just randomly pin some of the hair down in different areas just to kind of secure it a little bit in place. And again, if you make your puff a little bit more smaller, it will look so much more better. But the bigger, the better, the higher the bun, the better. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and just finish on my hair. And this is what your hair should look like. It looked like you had a shave off the side of your head a little bit. It's very funky very cute is very big and curly just make sure you pull the back part of your hair down so you look like a frohawk and absolutely love it if you are going out just make sure your edges are really really nice and smooth because you just look absolutely gorgeous tie your hair down for like 15 to 20 minutes and this is what your hair should look like really really fabulous this is great for a night out i hope you guys enjoy this video thumbs up if you do and yeah don't forget to subscribe to my channel and check out my previous video you guys on this makeup tutorial look that I created for you guys for the holiday. Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys. Bye.